Scarlett Johansson is best known for playing Natasha Romanoff, aka Black Widow, in The Avengers. While most Avengers of some sort of superpower or super suit, Black Widow has earned her place within the group as one of the world's best assassins. Welcome on our channel, Celebrity Diet and Workout, where we bring you the fitness regime of your favorite celebrities. Besides her good acting skills, what makes her the best cast for this role is the physique she consistently works with. Do you think it's easy to fight a villain who's twice her size and sometimes even triple like Thanos? Every flip and nose break her kicks isn't easy either. Most of them are stunts, but you have to look the part, and Scarlett Johansson looks the part. To keep Black Widow as strong and healthy as she is, she has her own unique exercise regimen and diet to match. That's why she's Black Widow. We're just normal people sitting behind the TV, admiring her decorations. Things about Scarlett Johansson and her workout routine. Before going into the training program to make Scarlett the villain, there are a few things that make her training program so effective that it would be unfair not to mention them. Scarlett Johansson Training Program Scarlett Johansson trains seven days a week. She always goes to the gym to work out her body. Her biggest challenge she faces during her training is finding the balance between fat loss and muscle building. As already mentioned, body restructuring is not the easiest thing to achieve. Day 1 – Total Body Circuit 1 On the first day of the week, Scarlett starts on a high note where she does a total body circuit routine that consists of eight different workouts. Here is what she does on Monday. 15 minutes on the treadmill, 20 reps of speed lunges, 10 reps of reverse lunges, 10 reps of jump squats, 10 reps of jump split squats, 10 reps of medicine ball slams, 10 reps of lateral pull downs with resistance band, 20 reps of both sides up ball hip abductions. Day 2 – Total Body Circuit 2 On the second day, Scarlett does yet another total body circuit routine. The difference between the second day and the first day routine is that the second day consists of 10 different exercises. 15 minutes on the treadmill, 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of squats, 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of bicep curls, 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of shoulder press, 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of front kicks, 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of Swiss ball alternating dumbbell chest press, 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of superset with tricep extensions, 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of weighted walking lunge with glute squeeze, 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of band rows, 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of stiff arm press downs or butterfly rows. Day 3 On the third day, Scarlett chooses to focus more on the legs and the core. A strong core is very important as this is where most of our movements originate from. Black Widow Deadlift A strong core also helps with good posture and reducing back pains. Having strong legs is important for Black Widow as we all know her signature move involves choking bad guys with her legs until they pass out. The legs and core workout routine she does on the third day consists of nine different exercises that are shown below. 15 minutes on the treadmill 3 to 4 sets of 10 reps of diagonal walks with mini bands 3 to 4 sets of 5 to 10 reps of butterfly steps 3 to 4 sets of 15 reps on each side of lifted heel squat. 3 to 4 sets of 10 reps on each side of standing leg rotations. 3 to 4 sets of 3 to 5 reps per side of cross back lunge with medicine ball pulses. 3 to 4 sets of 10 reps of reverse lunge with dumbbell press. 3 to 4 sets of 10 reps of side to side speed skaters. 3 to 4 sets of 10 reps of T push ups. Day 4 Total Body Circuit 3 on the fourth day, Scarlett goes back to circuit training. Her fourth day workout routine consists of 11 different exercises. Here are the exercises. 15 minutes on the treadmill. Two sets of 25 to 30 reps of dumbbell squat and press. Two sets of 25 to 30 reps of bicep curls into overhead press. Two sets of 25 to 30 reps of push-ups into side planks. Two sets of 25 to 30 reps of pull-ups. 2 sets of 25 to 30 reps of dumbbell tricep extensions, 2 sets of 50 reps of stomach crunches, 2 sets of 50 reps of alternating bicycle crunches, 2 sets of 50 reps of plank with knee thrust, 2 sets of 50 reps of reverse crunches, 2 sets of 50 reps of core stabilizing hip twists. Day 5 – Plyometric Circuit on the fifth day, Scarlett usually does a plyometric circuit training program that begins with a short warm-up followed by five different exercises. 
Here is what a fifth day looks like. 15 minutes on treadmill. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of speed lunges. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of reverse lunges. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of jump squats. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of jump split squats. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of kettlebell swings. Day 6. Muscle Building Circuit On the sixth day, it's all about getting ripped. Here, she does seven different workouts that are focused on engaging the different parts of her body for a full body strength training workout. Here are the exercises involved. 15 minutes on the treadmill. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of side lateral raises. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of front lateral raises. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of bicep curls. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of bent over rows. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of tricep kickbacks. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of V ups. Day 7 Total Body Circuit 4. On the last day of the week, we go back to circuit training. Total Body Circuit 4 consists of a warm up and six exercises as shown below 15 minutes on the treadmill, 10 minutes of shadow boxing. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of T push ups. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of speed lunges. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of T extensions. 3 to 4 sets of 25 to 30 reps of jump squats. 10 reps of 30 second holds of planks. That's everything you need to know about Scarlett Johansson's workout routine. If you're keen, you'll notice she starts every workout by warming up on the treadmill. Warming up before a workout helps loosen the muscles and this helps prevent injuries from happening. Scarlett Johansson Diet Training is only half the journey. The other half depends on what you're eating. Scarlett knows it all too well. Not much is known about her diet, but what is known about her diet is that she mostly oscillates between high-carb, low-fat and high-fat diets. In both cases, protein intake remains the same. Choosing between the two diets is primarily influenced by the training needs of the week or her day. If she exercises a lot, she goes on a high-carb, low-fat diet because it gives her the energy she needs to kill it in the gym. Choose a low-carb diet. There's also a time limit for eating. Scarlett Johansson has a fasting period of 12 hours each day. This means that she can only eat for 12 hours a day and must not touch food for the remaining 12 hours. There are days when 12 hours turns into 14 or 15 hour fasting windows. It all depends on her filming schedule. As you've seen, she puts work into being the tough girl she is. This workout and diet plan is not for everyone and hence if you're thinking of trying it, you should make sure an expert gives you the green light as some of the exercises in a workout routine need someone who knows their way around the gym. That's it in today's video. Do like and share the video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.